Go ahead and check out my sponsor's link in the description box below. Rumor has it that Pharrell Williams led on a very successful, okay, Louis Vuitton campaign. With that being said, Virgil Alo is probably proud, okay, looking down. I do want to say this. There was quite a few big names that showed up, okay, in support of and in light of the, uh, uh, the um, festivities there at the Louis Vuitton campaign. Now, I know this is a big weight on Pharrell's shoulders, okay? Let's not be tripping. I, for one, was wondering who is going to take Virgil's place, you know, after the fact. I knew that there was a bunch of new music out, okay, little dirt? But with that being said, uh, there's a lot that it's, it's a, I want to say it is a, a big pair of pants to fill, right? I was on, uh, I want to say, I was on the verge of thinking that they were going to put Kanye in that place. But I want, to, I want to say that they picked somebody of sound mind, right? And Pharrell's been in and out the business, ghost writing, okay, beat making, and with that kind of money, okay, because he's he's accumulated some change, okay, he never he never leaves money on the floor. And um, as my understanding, he gets project uh, royalties from NERD. You have, I think there's like two or three, right? Now with him being CEO of a couple companies, and I don't know, I'm gonna have to fact check that. <laughs> and also now taking on the role of the creative designer of Louis Vuitton. Um, I think that he's got all his besties in a Rolodex. It's like, hey, there's a campaign going on this weekend. Everybody's showing up and boop, boop, boop. It's like a P. Diddy party. Anyway, with that being said, Beyonce and Jay-Z showed up, okay? Now, I don't know if you guys are watching Beyonce and this new tour that she's got going on. Blue Ivy stands alongside of her, right? Now, first, I'm not going to lie. When they first started putting out clips of Blue Ivy, she was barely moving. I think she didn't want to make Beyonce mad. She didn't want to overshine her. <laughs> she was like, oh, girl. <laughs> she had to look over at her mom like, is it okay to move? Now we're like two weeks in and she's, doo -doo 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 girl, bye. <laughs> she is pulling it off and her mom is side eyeing her like no you ain't out shining me <laughs> if y'all seen like uh i would say pat benatar has got a daughter that she told her you can't outshine me uh diana summer donna summers told her daughter you can't outshine me look a lot of these kids they just know <laughs> that whenever their moms are like you know uh, that viral sensation of the time you know what i mean like pat benatar like donna summers once was it's, it's a lot. It's a lot of pressure. But I think whenever these kids come out the box, they do. They come out and they show out. Okay? I'm scared. But I'm also surprised that Pharrell didn't have her perform right there with a little Blue Ivy <laughs> beside her. I want to hear your thoughts and theories in the comment section below. As well, if you have not checked out my sponsor, go on and do that. That is Glow Skin Guide. All of your skincare needs all in one, okay? I don't care if you've got glowing skin to acne skin. You're going to want this guide. Link in the description box below. Bye.